Multi-track audio is really important in podcast production because when you have four microphones, it's great to have four individual audio files for each track for each microphone. Like that's, it just makes sense because throughout the entirety of a podcast, somebody could be coughing. Somebody could be speaking a little bit louder. Some, somebody could be speaking a little bit lower and having the ability to just edit that one specific microphone is vitally important. That's why I love multi-track audio. And the way that I edit multi-track audio is actually using Auphonic. Um, I really love Auphonic and I'll show you how I edit multi-track audio. All right, we have Auphonic loaded up right here. And what I'm gonna do is click this little arrow right here and this little window should pop up and click multi-track. And simply I can put track one, I can type uh, Gil's mic and I can say, hey, I want to be able to add another track. You know, let's call this Alex Zandra's mic. As you can see right here um, for Alexandra's mic, I can upload the audio file and she could have her own settings right here. So if I know that she speaks a little bit louder, I can then, you know, make some adjustments here. I could EQ her mic differently than my mic. Um, we can add, let's see how many mics can we add? I don't know if there's like a, a limit. We can add as many tracks of audio as we want to. And as you can see, we have so many settings for each individual microphone. So I uploaded a piece of audio for Gil mic and Alex mic, and we can just hit start production. So I'll hit start production, upload all the files. Alfano could do his processing thing. After the upload, you then will be able to download each individual track and they will be edited the way that you chose. Alphonic is really powerful and it is my tool, the key tool that I use for multi-track podcast audio production. So if you enjoyed this video, please comment down below, like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.